What's going on guys, JT Bedford here, with another episode of L.A. Noir. We just left off by checking out the, the old wheel. lady's house that and just where died. where exactly are we going? We're going to go to her husband's house. Jacob Henry had a violent argument with his wife last night. He's looking more and more likely. Uh, with my money, the block keep the house looking like that's so probably preserved. Skipper says bring him in. Keep the hacks off our backs for a while. Fine by me. So it ain't the werewolf killer after all. Good to see you come to the senses, Cole. Are you I always said backwards? work the evidence. I only stipulated a connection to the BD killer as an avenue of investigation we should leave open. And as far as I'm concerned, it still is. Okay, Phelps, we go in hard. You follow my lead. Woohoo, giggity. Going hard, do we? You Jacob Henry? Yeah. Who's asking? LAPD. You're under arrest for the murder of your wife, Celine Henry. Murder? Celine? Save the dramatic oh, oh my for God. RKO, pal. You got a bigger problem. What the hell are you talking about? You come in here, you tell me that Celine is. Take a seat, Mr. Henry. She's... We're going to have a look around, uh, then we'll talk. Jesus, I'm sorry. Uh, uh. Yeah, bitch. I guess you're the slightest hint that you're a flight risk, pal. I think the atmosphere is thick in the air. Ooh, giggity. He'll be back in the The oldest problem there is, what to do about the old lady. I doubt it. Just a baseball bat. Those are all locked. Alright, let's go talk to this son of a bitch. So who could have killed Celine? Where did she go last night? A bar, I suppose. Look, I don't know. get the impression that Celine liked to live a glamorous life. How did she end up with a hump like you, Jacob? Celine was one of the first woman pilots. She hung out with movie stars and royalty. But when she came back here broke and struggling, she married a mechanic, put a roof over her head, food on the table. Not glamorous, but the best I could do. I'm not ashamed about that. Bet you not, bitch. When did you last see your wife, Mr. Henry? Last night. I went to see her. We talked. Things got a little out of hand. 
I left. I think he's telling the truth. You don't remember what time you last saw your wife alive? Look, I'm sorry. I left. Maybe 9 p.m. Might have been a little later, but right around 9. Why did you kill her, Jacob? Things will go better if you come clean about it. That's a lousy thing to say. I never gave up on my wife. I don't believe you, Jacob. I think you didn't have the guts to do it yourself, so you had someone else do it. You want to back that up with something, Big Mouth? Huh? Damn it. I've had just about enough of you. So you can prove that you came back here after you left your wife's place. I came back here. I was here all night. Start work at 6.30. Not the going out type. You called the bar to give yourself an alibi. Then you went after her, beat her, and dumped her in a park. I think you are a sack of shit, Jacob. You're not going to pin Celine's death on me. I'll take a lie detector test to prove it. McCall says he called and called and you didn't pick up. I tried to get her help and she laughed in my face. Well, then, of course, she needs me. I'd had enough. No one has their limit. We're still gonna need you to come downtown, Mr. Henry. We can get this all down on paper, Jacob. How you got fed up with your wife and how you figured killing her would bury all your troubles. Kill my own wife? She was a loss in a trap and you just couldn't stand it anymore. Shut your goddamn mouth. <laughs> so now you're gonna tell me you loved her? Ah, the DA goes all gooey over remorse, Jacob. Oh, Doesn't look good for you, Jacob. Okay. Punched you in the face. Call it in and get a squad car dispatched. And check for messages. I'll keep old Slugger here company. <laughs> you got beat up. You got beat up. Operator, give me dispatch. Putting you through now. Phelps, one, two, four, seven. How can I help, detective? I need a patrol unit to transport a suspect back to Central. Certainly, detective. You have a message from the coroner. Do you wish to be put through? Yes, ma'am. Carruthers. It's Phelps. I've completed the autopsy. Several wounds to the head from a blunt metal instrument. Closest match would be a socket wrench handle. So the cause of death was the blunt? No, the blows to the head surprisingly were not fatal. Death was from hemorrhage and shock from the fractured ribs and multiple injuries caused by the stomping. Anything else? He's some kind of sex fiend. The tissues of the anus were bruised about one eighth of an inch, <laughs> but no trace of Boy. semen in the anus, vagina, or stomach. Thanks, Doctor. Operator, give me R&I. 
Any word on an owner for that vehicle? License was 2Boy8899. Yes, Detective. The plate belongs to a brown 1936 Pontiac. Registered owner is one Alonzo Mendez of 402 South Fremont Street, apartment 16. Thanks. Any other messages? One, Detective. From Captain Donnelly. He wants any and all suspects returned to Central. Interviews to be set up immediately. Got it. We're coming in. He's only a writer, so he can't really help me. That's the guy from the papers. South Can you drive to this one? Fine. Where are we headed? Her brother said she took a real pounding. Maybe if he had been a little firmer in the beginning, he wouldn't be in this situation now. I imagine that Neanderthal routine is a big hit with the ladies, Galloway. <laughs> Women love me, though. I have no complexity. They know exactly what they're gonna get. Mendez, apartment 16. All the way to the top. Here, the apartment's up on the top floor. Can I fucking do it today, stupid? Don't bother knocking, just kick the door in. Take a look around and see what you can find. Okay. Optimistic call. This isn't what we're looking for. Circumstantial. Check it to page you. Don't think this is anything. Others can match the color and brand of the body. Consistent with Celine's injuries, and the blood can be typed. We have the murder weapon. We better get Pinker down here. Why keep it? Why not throw it away? You think these clowns are geniuses? Thank your stars you caught a break, and Captain Donald would begin to like you. What gives? LAPD, you're under arrest. Do not lose that son of a God bitch. Damn it. I'll go get our wheels. Mendez, stop right there. Why am I always the one that has to run after these people? You don't need to do this, Alonzo.
Get in and drive. Hit him, Cole. Spin him out. Oh shit! Keep me alongside his vehicle and I'll stop this son of a bitch. Um. Um. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm gonna have to redo this one. I'm a little stuck. I know he escaped. I ain't never seen a car do that before. God damn it, get after him, Cole. Hit it! Clean this asshole off the road. I got an idea. Get him next to my window, Cole. Keep me alongside his vehicle and I'll stop this son of a bitch. Hit him, Cole. Spit him out. Well, I would, but I can't catch up to him. Phelps, you gotta get me closer. You're under arrest for the murder of Celine Henry. I ain't saying a goddamn thing. Yeah, that bitch. You did a grand job, lads. Phelps, that's quite a way to acquit yourself in your first outing as a homicide investigator. It seems the city has a new and vengeful guardian. Considering the evidence against your suspect, and the thoroughness with which a report was compiled, I foresee a safe passage through the courts, and the DA agrees with me. Brutality on a scale such as this deserves retribution. The people and the press of this city demand it. Alright guys, that's going to do it for this episode of LA Noir. If you like what you see, make sure you hit the like button. If you want to see more, hit the subscribe button. If you want to know when I'm posting a video, make sure you hit the little bell next to my subscribe button. That'll notify you any time a video goes up. As well as going to my Facebook page and also the Outcast Posse Facebook page, which the links are in the description below as always guys. And also don't forget to check out everybody's YouTube channel and everybody's Twitch channel. Make sure you check out both Twitch and YouTube. See what everybody's got going on. See all the good stuff. But until next time, everybody, I'll talk to y'all later.